In this video, I'll be making Oprah Winfrey's famous coconut French toast using the recipe she provided on her Oprah website. And then I'll give you my review on it at the end. So stay tuned. Oprah posted on her Twitter and Instagram of her making these amazing must-try homemade coconut French toasts. Then she shared her recipe on her website, Oprah.com. Her recipe serves four people or eight French toasts. Instead, I'm going to half her recipe since I don't need to make that many French toasts. I'll list the exact measuring ingredients that I use below in the description. But here are all the ingredients needed. So let's get started. First, we're going to toast one cup of shredded unsweetened coconut and we'll spread that out in a pan. Her instructions say to bake 8 to 10 minutes until golden brown at 350 degrees. The first time I baked it for exactly 8 minutes, it came out burnt, seen here. So I'm redoing it again and baking it for 4 minutes instead. Meanwhile, to prepare the mixture, in a large mixing bowl, crack two large eggs. Add one fourth cup of sugar. And now whisk the eggs and sugar to combine. Add half cup of half and half. One fourth cup of sour cream. I'm going to eyeball the amount. A half teaspoon of vanilla extract. One eighth teaspoon of kosher salt. And now whisk all the ingredients together well. And that's it for the mixture. And after 4 minutes, here's the coconut shreds, exactly what we need. It's golden brown, but not burnt. So first, we're going to dip the bread on both sides into the egg mixture. Then transfer to the plate of toasted coconut, coating only one side of bread in the coconut. And then repeat with another piece of bread. I'll be doing this until I have no more egg mixture or coconut left to see how many toasts I can make. Feel free to add any extra coconut back onto the bread so it's completely covered in coconut. And there you go. From this, I was able to prepare six French toasts. And just as an extra test, I'm going to dip one extra bread in the egg mixture and use the same coconut flakes that's not toasted. I just want to see if it would taste any different. This will be the last and the seventh toast. Now to toast the bread on medium heat, add about half tablespoon of butter in a skillet. When the butter starts to bubble, add the bread sliced coconut side down. Since I can fit another toast in the skillet, I'm going to repeat and add butter and again place the coconut side down first. Cook until golden brown, about 2 minutes. Then flip the bread and cook on the other side until golden brown, about 1 minute more. And repeat with the remaining slices of bread.
Now that we've toasted all the bread on each side using a fine mesh strainer, thus confectioner's sugar or powdered sugar, on top of each slice. Then drizzle some maple syrup over. And now top it off with whipped cream. I'm using coconut whipped topping here. I got this one particularly at Trader Joe's. There you go, we're done serving Oprah's Coconut French Toast. I'm excited to give this one a try. We'll give you my taste review next. All right, I'm gonna taste test Oprah Winfrey's Coconut French Toast. Oh, these look really good. Mmm, smells very coconut toasty. So let's give these a try. They look so good. The bread is so soft and moist. Right away you taste the sweetness of the coconut, the maple syrup. Kind of biting into the shredded coconut. Oh yeah, this is good. This is very nice. I'm loving this. It has a good amount of coconut flavor in here. Perfect. It's funny that the shredded coconut was unsweetened, but this whole thing tastes sweet. Maybe because of the sugar and the maple syrup. That was very, very good. Wow, I didn't expect it to be that good. Let's try the white coconut that I didn't toast in the oven. See how this comes out. Okay, this one, the white one, I can tell it's not as crunchy. It's more soft, the coconut, which isn't bad. I think you just have to chew on it more. Yeah, not bad at all. They're both good. It's so soft. Everything, the bread, the mixture, made it a little soft and soggy, but it's a perfect amount. It melts in your mouth. The coconut flavor is on point on these. Gonna add more coconut whipped cream. First time I'm trying this, this is from Trader Joe's. Just added a whole bunch. Round three. Seriously, these are so, so good. These are so good. Definitely restaurant quality. I can definitely see these being served in a high-end restaurant. These are really good. I can see why Oprah would eat this. It's definitely high quality. French toast, coconut flavor. If you love coconut, you'll love this. Mm -hmm. For sure. I would give this French toast a definite 10 out of a 10. It's really good. Must try. Especially me if you love coconut. You will love these. These are so good. 10 out of a 10. Two thumbs up. There you go. Oprah's coconut French toast. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, take care and I'll see you in the next one. Aloha. Thank you.